Hi, Simon here from Gold Coast Solar Power Solutions and today we have a Fronius IG60 solar inverter and you can see on the screen of this one it's showing state 421. Now according to Fronius, a state 421 is an internal hardware sequence collision and now uh, that's an internal fault with the inverter and uh, if it doesn't clear itself it is something which is going to need to be uh, repaired by a Fronius service agent so uh, look, the first thing to always try and do is try to reboot the system and see if that clears the area, the error, sorry. And uh, to do that, we always follow the shutdown procedure, which is we turn off the solar supply main switch in the switchboard, which we can find over here. There we are, we just throw that one off. And then we turn off the PV ray DC isolator. You might have multiple PV ray DC isolators. This one's got a bit moldy, but we just uh, throw that one off and we'll wait for the inverter to go completely blank just give it a few moments and there we go the inverter's gone completely dead and then we'll try a reboot of the inverter now the reboot uh, procedure isn't as important as a shutdown procedure but what we'll do is we'll turn on the DC and then we'll throw on the AC as well. And the inverter will go through a startup procedure, which usually takes a couple of minutes. And so we'll wait to see if the error clears from there. Now, uh, if the the, the Fronius IG60 inverters usually came with a uh, five-year warranty as standard. So if your inverter was installed within the last five years and it is coming up with a state 421 error like this, it is covered under warranty and I'd recommend you get in contact with a local Fronius service agent such as Gold Coast Solar Power Solutions if you're on the Gold Coast or South East Queensland area. We'd be uh, happy to help you. One thing we will need to make any warranty claim is the serial number of the inverter which can be found underneath the inverter. We have a look down here. We've got the uh, data plate of the inverter and up here we've got the serial number of the inverter. So you will need that serial number. As you can see this one it's come back with state 421 and so this is an internal uh, hardware sequence collision error and uh, is going to have to uh, be repaired which we'll be doing now now look if your inverter is older than five years old and it's no longer under warranty then you've got a couple of options you can pay to get it repaired or you can uh, bite the bullet and replace the inverter you will be up for quite a bit of money to actually repair it if it's outside of the warranty so i usually recommend uh, replace the inverter altogether with a brand new one with a full warranty the new Fronius inverters come standard with a 10-year warranty which is really good so look i hope this video has been helpful for you if you've got a problem like this like the uh, state 421 error on your Fronius inverter and you're near the gold coast or brisbane area don't hesitate to get in contact with Gold Coast Solar Power Solutions. We can certainly help you. Thanks very much. I hope this video has been helpful for you.